Hey, a pleasant good morning, everybody. This is Sports for Night News. I'm Joe Borg, and this is going to be a quick recap of the great 3-2 start to the World Junior Championship a win over Slovakia by Team USA as Matthew Nyes, um, Mackey, Samakevich, and Landon Slaggart were all able to pot goals for Team USA as Martin Kromiak was the star of the game as literally only he was able to pot goals for Slovakia. But Drew Camaso, as they said on the broadcast, rounding it out, was the star of this game for Team USA, particularly in the third period, as Team USA's goaltender, Drew Camaso, really stepped up as Slovakia had a great late push. And then Morton Kromiak missed the net, just missed the net late in the third, where this was similarly to last year's game against Slovakia. A game that worried you at moments, being a USA fan toward the end, as it got very close in a 3-2 game. But for most of the game, I will say Team USA dominated and was the driving force of this game, leading to the shots being the magical number 42 to 25 shots um, for Slovakia. Total, Matthew Nyes from Logan Cooley, a great draft prospect in this year's draft. And Jack Pert was able to get the great one-timer goal to kick off the scoring. Team USA started a little sloppy getting um, used to each other and the new team in this game, even though they did have the preliminary game as they took a bad too many men penalty and another penalty. But Simon Lukowski, um, the goaltender for Slovakia, who was able to win the Clark Cup with the Chicago Steel against Jack Pert, actually, um, was very good, and he was a star of the game as well. He was a big reason Slovakia was able to even come back in the third period. Otherwise, it could have been 6 nothing at that point. USA, where Martin Kromiak's goals would have been obsolete and not even mattered. So, Simon Lukotsi, um, who has a chance to be a good NHL goaltender once he gets drafted and picked up by somebody, um, is, is really developing into a great goaltender in the USHL. And as they said on the broadcast, is a great story if you want to look it up where uh, he got to stay around because he did so good in the World Juniors last year and dominate for the Chicago Steel to then get them that Clark Cup. But he was definitely a star of the game. Uh, I would probably give him, just because he kept his team in the game, be able to come back in the third period, the second star of this game. And then I would give Drew Camaso for Team USA the third star of this game for how good he was able to really be Mr. Clutch and close out the third period as he had a great third period for Team USA. And then Matthew Nyes, um, who was, a, or not Matthew Nyes, Landon Slaggard, who was able to crash the net, which is exactly what Slaggard does, who was able to crash the net and get a beautiful goal, um, would then be the first star since he ended up having the game-winning goal at that point. Nyes, Toronto's prospect, started the scoring, Landon Slaggart, who was Chicago's prospect, ended the scoring, crashing the net. He'll be a great player for the Blackhawks if he's able to just be that hard nose to the grindstone, no denial, crashing the net player. That's an exact player that they could use. And then Chaz Lucis, who uh, was on the fourth line from the Winnipeg Jets organization, I thought looked very good as well for Team USA in this game, as well as Dominic James, who's uh, draft eligible, who looked like he was banged up, but was able to come back. I thought he looked good. In limited action with Logan Cooley looked absolutely fantastic, um, especially, <clears throat> of course, on the great pass to be able to set up the goal by Matthew Nyes on the power play. Uh, this was just a great overall game for Team USA. Matt, Matty Samakevich um, was just able to absolutely snipe it. Matty Samakevich is an absolute dynamite shot. Um, it's going to be hard to be able to stop him once he gets up to the NHL. So um, let me look out for Mackie C. McKevich, where Florida does not even need any more talent at that point when it comes to scoring. So again, the stars of this game are Landon Slaggard. He would get the first star because he ended up getting the game-winning goal. Martin Kromiak um, definitely was a star of the game. Um, for Slovakia, that's for darn sure. And then we also have Drew Camaso as the third star. And then Simon Lukowski has to be the second star of this game. Because Slovakia wouldn't have had a chance for Morning Chromiak's two goals if it wasn't for Simon Lukowski, who again was a Clark Cup winner with Chicago Steel just last year, so earning his stripe. Again, by having a great World Junior start, he was the star of the game along with Morning Chromiak. 
for Slovakia, but Team USA dominated the most of the game and set the tempo in the first two periods and then was able to hang on in the third period thanks to Mr. Clutch, Drew Camaso in that. This was a great first start for the Americans um, as they were able to also have a good penalty kill uh, minus... Of course, the one goal by Morton Chromiak, that was an absolute wire that Drew Camaso had no chance to stop. But overall, they had a good penalty kill, taking a few too many penalties, 12 penalty minutes. So you want to bring that down a little bit, but had a good penalty kill. And then Chromiak scored his second goal literally just as the goaltender was pulled. So, all in all, good first start for Team USA. Some things you want to clean up in this game as you start playing better opponents. Slovakia is a hell of a team with... Great guys competitive for next year's, competing for next year's draft, excuse me, and prospects that have already been picked. But um, Team USA should beat Slovakia, and that is exactly what they did. Morning Chromiak should be the best player on the team, and that is exactly what he was. Simon Nemec was also a stud out there, who was one of the top um, defensive prospects uh, for next year's draft as well. So obviously look out for him, but Simon Nemec was definitely an absolute stud out there as well. And then also, when it comes to guys for next year's draft, Juraj Slavosk, uh, yes, yeah, Slavkovsky, I thought looked solid as a forward as well. But obviously, Chromiak was the star of the game for Slovakia overall. So everybody have a great, safe, and pleasant day. It was a great first day of World Juniors. It looks like how we say it could be a repeat of the gold game. Well, both Team Canada and both Team USA took care of business on day one. Have a great, safe, and pleasant day, everybody. Please continue to subscribe down below if you enjoyed the content or up above in the easy to use. Wish it to help us get to 185 by year's end. What a great first day of World Juniors. Continue to enjoy the great World Junior Hockey. Peace out, everybody.